This little painting is of a gorge. It reminds me of the many gorges in the Blue Mountains along the east coast of Australia. This short lesson was extracted from the 30 minute lesson available on DVD. We start by undercoating the sky in white and then adding the blue into the wet white paint. We paint from the top down and this gives us a very blue sky at the top and a whiter sky at the bottom. With a different blue we use ultramarine blue and with the white we can scrub it into mountains. The mountains are very pale in the distance and very steep. Mountains get darker as they come towards us. Keep the ridge line of your mountain quite dark and the body of the mountain gets paler as it disappears behind the other mountain. You can block your mountain in with full colour and then come back with a white paint and tone it down by mixing the two colours together. The mountains near us can become quite dark so we paint with ultramarine blue, we add crimson and a very little bit of raw sienna. And with a mixture of raw sienna and a little bit of blue, we dab, dab, dab the foliage on that distant mountain. With the painting knife, we sculpture on the rocks in burnt umber. And then with burnt sienna and white, place the sunlight on top of the rock. Practice double loading your painting knife You'll find it's easy to sculpture in your trees. Or if you wish to brush them in, you can also brush them in. Put your tree trunks in where it suits you. Don't try and copy my painting. Make it up as you go along. Then with a little hairbrush, we zigzag in our branches. Now we mix our green for our leaves on the tree. Here I'm using warm yellow, a bit of crimson, a little bit of blue, a little bit of raw sienna, but don't mix them completely. Load your big hog bristle brush with dark on one side and the green on the other, and then we can dab, dab, dab the foliage on the trees. Now to finish off the painting, we tidy up the grass, put a few little flowers in the middle, and a few highlights along the top of the rock where the sun bounces off the corner of the rock. Take off the masking tape and that's our little painting finished. Well I hope to see you again. Thank you.